Hello everyone, welcome to Oracle Hitsim Cloud. Let's have a look at how to create a cost allocation Keyflex field structure. Let's go to the username, setup and maintenance. Task area, implementation projects, and choose your project. Let me search for BMW. Okay. And search for the task Manage Cost Allocation Key Flex Field. the task so we're going to do it in few steps the first step is to create the structure then we're going to create a segment then we need to make an instance for it and then finally we will deploy it so to create the structure let's click on manage structure imagine we're going to create a structure for a country so let's click on create button and a structure code, so let's say BMW UK cost allocation key flex view, and we'll stick the same for the name and the description. Okay, so delimiter we will pick dot or whichever you want to do it. Make sure it is enabled before you're going to create the segment. Save. So once you saved it, you can uh, click on create the segment. So we're going to create a segment called company and AP name will be auto generated. So let's put the name, description and a sequence number will stick as 10. Prompt, you can do as company. Short prompt, we'll put it at CO, make sure that's enabled. Display width, we can stick it, that's a length, so we will say 5 for it. You can ignore the range. Column name, we will say segment 1. Default value set code. This is usually provided by the financial team. Um, I haven't created one, so let's see whether we can get one for the company. Let's search for... Okay. Let's use this one. Okay. So the next one is segment labels. Choose the segment labels depending on which or places you want to display the field called company. For instance, if you're creating a department and if you want to do the costing uh, by a company level, you can choose it. So let's say, let's choose department. And uh, while you're creating a job, if you want to do the costing on a company level, choose job and uh, say payroll, okay? And uh, click on save and close. Okay. And save and close. That's, uh, that's been created, so click save and close again. Done. So the next step is to create the structure instance. So let's click on manage structure instances. Click on create. And uh, let's put the same name or whichever name you wanna put. So, The API name will be auto generated. Put the description in there. Make sure it's enabled and make sure uh, the dynamic combination creation allowed ticked as well. And pick the structure name what we created, which is BMW UK Coastal Location KFF. So when you choose that, you automatically get the segment code we created. So that's there. Save and close. And done. And finally, click on Deploy Flex Field. So that's been completed. Click OK. And as you could see, the deployment status has been changed to green tick, which means that's all we've done. So that's pretty much all done. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.